If you've ever used the Altrix platform before, you probably already know how easy and intuitive it is to use, even if you don't have much of a coding background. However, if you're just getting started, um, using things like formulas and filters and getting familiar with the Altrix syntax, that can be a bit of a learning curve. Now, one option you have is utilizing something like ChatGPT to help you put together those formulas. So let's say I have a data set like below where I have a bunch of different stores and I have detail on sales, credit sales, number of customers, um, and maybe I'm trying to create some groupings based on these metrics. So if we're looking at something like total customers, uh, maybe I'm trying to group these into categories such as you know high, medium, low, um, and create a new column to kind of bucket that together. Well, one thing I could do is bring in ChatGPT and kind of type out what it is I'm trying to do. So here I wanted to write an Altrix formula to create a conditional statement grouping our total stores as high, if it's greater than 300, medium, if it's greater than 100, and anything below that we wanna set as low. So here, I'm gonna go ahead and ask it that question, and we'll see just within a matter of seconds, we're gonna get a response here, as well as a formula that we can then use. Now, we can see that the formula is finished, and it's also provided us a little bit of documentation around how the formula would work. So from here, I can come copy my code, bring in a formula tool, paste in my formula, we'll give it a new column name, maybe this is my customer grouping, we'll click run, and now if we check our output, we now have a new column with the specific logic that we have set here. Give it a try for yourself.